Hi, much love. Um, this is Chubby Love. Um, responding to the video that you posted on the dark skin girls, and I am one. And as you know, I had to speak on this because I think it is really heartbreaking that this is continuing to go on within our race. Uh, I remember this same ignorance when I was a kid in what kindergarten, first grade, where um, I was teased because I was um, darker than the, um, other children that were in the class. Um, I don't think, I, I think I, I escaped a lot of scars with that because I, I was re, it was reinforced at home early on before I even uh, attended school um, how beautiful I was and how special I was and how unique I was and um, and I think that that was laid that foundation was laid and I think it just was more potent than <laughs> the insults that were um, lobbed my way and I find it interesting that people want to tear someone else down um, instead of building them up because you know we're supposed to 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 lend a hand to our fellow man and and, and not try to deflate someone if that if you can't say something to someone to lift their their spirits up or to make them feel better, um, then don't make them feel worse. You know, I mean, I think it's just ridiculous. And I, but I do think, from my experience with um, being teased in school, I think the um, residual effect of that is I tend to 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 lift people up. I I I. I I live children when I see children I make I, I, I let them know that they're something special I let them know that they're beautiful and I and you know and I let them know that they can be anything that they want to be and, and you know I, I go out of my way with my nieces and nephews to make sure that they know that they are something special to make sure that they know there's nobody else in this world like you nobody else can be you you know that's how unique you are you know and yes you have a you I, I have a unique um, color this is my color this is my skin nobody else has this skin nobody else has this color that is a unique thing you know these this brain nobody else has this brain you know nobody else has the education that I strive for and that I've obtained because that's uniquely mine but you can have yours you know and you know and I feel that when people are attacking other people to make them feel bad about themselves whether it's color whether it's weight whether it's um your um your living area whether it's um you know whatever it is whenever you have to pull somebody else down to make yourself shine you really need to do some soul searching and, and really need to um, um, really change some things in your life and get yourself right because you don't have to push someone else down to lift yourself up there's enough room for everybody you know and um it's just a sad, it's a sad, sad thing, but it's, it's very true. And I find that whenever I bring this situ this issue up, because I have, you know, because I do um, a lot of questions. I ask a lot of questions about different things to make people think. And when you start to ask these type of questions, about it, a lot of people deny that it even exists in our race, which I find is just mind-blowing. But, um... Yeah, it's it's a it's an interesting thing. It's it, it it's a shame that it's still here. It really is. It's hopefully, you know, 
um, but by talking about it, by talking about it and putting it out there and showing people how ignorant this is to have to 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 to, to um, I guess what I'm trying to say is when you when you put it out there and you talk about it, sometimes things are not the, you can't see just you can't you can see things better when you put it out there and, and, and you know and you you say it and you can look at it. You know, it's almost like a journal. If you think it, you um, it's one thing. But when you start journaling and you you read it, I find that uh, when I journal, I can see clearer when I see it on paper. So maybe you know, I'm thinking hopefully with your videos and other videos and it you know it'll get us talking, putting it out there where we can see it. Um, maybe it'll change some people. We may not change. You may not change everybody at one time, but all it takes is a seed to be planted, and it'll just continue, and it has to start somewhere, you know. But um, I wanted to say I appreciate your videos. Um, uh, this one, as well as the Mob Wives, you can't. Get, I'm gonna need you to keep doing the Mob Wives. <laughs> Because I look forward to that, and um, but you still can tackle these issues uh, and other important things to you. But um, you know, I enjoy all of your videos. They're thought provoking. This this was a very thought provoking um, one, and you bring a lot of a lot of other videos to the surface that I, I truly enjoy. Um, um, I think that's about it. Um, and um, I just want to say thank you, and I want to respond. Bye.